In this video, we are going to walk through how to log in and add textbooks to your classes in Savas. First, you'll need to access Clever to log in. In the upper left corner, when you're logged into Google, you can access BGPS bookmarks, choose the Clever login, and log in with your district account. Then you can scroll down to the bottom in district resources. You can favorite the Savas EasyBridge for easier access up at the top in your favorites. And then all you have to do is click that card and it will log you in automatically through Clever. The EasyBridge is the connection between um, your classes and assigning the books and the actual textbook platform, which is Realize. And so you'll see that on the right side, the learning systems, we've got Savas Realize. And then our classes are listed here in the middle. If you do this during your semester, you'll see your classes listed under current classes. If you set this up before the semester, has started, your classes will be listed under future classes. So you can see your classes are going to be listed and you'll have a button to click to check your student roster if needed. And then there's going to be the important button that's add products on the right side of your classes. You'll need to click add products and it will have a list of all of the available digital textbooks. So you can scroll through and find the book that you need to assign to this class and just select it with the checkbox on the left side. So we're gonna scroll through and select the book for this class and click the checkbox on the left side and then click save and that will automatically assign that book to this class and then it will be active and available for students when they sign in to Hello ID and they'll be able to see and access that book. So now we see that there's a product available for this class and the button has changed to manage products. So you can click on manage products at any time and see which one is current and edit or update to add any other additional products or online textbooks. So we can click on the title of the textbook and it will automatically bring us into Savas Realize. And we can see our classes here and there's a nice little walkthrough tour. And so we'll go through that. Um, that will um, explain the new pieces in the Realize dashboard. So over on the right, you have the programs that are assigned to you, the ones that you have available um, for your classes. So you might have multiple programs um, if you teach different subjects for different grade levels. And then your main classes or the class cards will be available here in the middle and they will each have um, quick shortcut buttons on them. So you can go to the assignments, you can go to the calendar, access the rosters or groups and the data. And then importantly, you can access the programs that are specific to that class using those buttons on the right. So those are available here on the kind of the home dashboard, but across the top, you will also have a main menu that will always be there. So you can browse the programs and the resources in those programs. So um, your different textbook resources, you can go to your individual classes. You can see your student data, your class data under my library. That's any content that you have added over on the right. You can search, you can see notifications and you can access their help center which is um, always great to be able to access that quickly when you need it. And then at the end, there is a nice video tutorial and you can access that anytime in that lower right corner. So this is the main Savas Realize dashboard um, that you can access after you have assigned your products or digital textbooks to your class, which you do need to do for each class each semester. So um, to give your students access to those textbooks, you'll need to add that product for each class each semester.